have questions about dating. So you have questions about dating. I'm going to let y'all know the real about dating. Y'all want to know the real about dating? Y'all want to know why women date certain men? Certain men we date. And those men are considered to be the betas and the simps. Because those are the men we can waste our time with. We can waste our time with those men because they like us. We don't really like them. Even if it doesn't matter if you, you think you look good. If I don't like you, I don't like you. But a woman can disguise how much she likes you. If she likes you, if she finds you attractive. A woman can see you and say, yeah, you look good. But we're not attracted, attracted to you. We can look at you and say, oh, man, he's a good looking man. I run across so many good looking men. So many good looking men like me. But that don't mean that I like them. It doesn't mean that I'm attracted to them. Do you understand what I'm saying? That's something right there men need to understand. That must be a must when you're dealing with any woman that you're dealing with. Any woman that you're dealing with, you must understand attraction. You have to. You have to understand attraction because attraction is going to dictate how far you guys go. Period. This is going to dictate how far you're going to go with the woman. A lot of men have not executed attraction that was never taught to them you never understood it maybe you get wishy-washy women women that play cold women that might have fucked you one time and you can't go back and fuck her then one minute she act like she like you the next minute she act like she don't like you that wishy-washy type of shit she could be just doing that until she get with the next man you're not the main man we're not gonna see we're not gonna play that game with the men that we want the men that we want, we're not going to play that game. But sometimes the men flip it on us and we be wanting him more than he want us. So that's when we begin to chase. Uh, a healthy woman that's dealing with a healthy man and you guys are reciprocating energy. You guys are not tracing each other. If you call her, she answers. If you text her, she replies. If, if she call you, you answer. If she texts you, you reply. You guys go out, you guys chill. It's no issue there. That's reciprocation. But if a man is dealing with, a lot of men like dealing with women that like them more. But those are men that understand the execution of women. They done developed their self and they done got so, um, give me a second here. They done got so. When it comes to women and dealing with women, they understand the woman's mind so well that they only deal with women that are extremely thirsty. So it's kind of like how women deal with betas and simps. But if you listen to the live stream I did on betas and simps, it's a clear difference. It is a difference. And I broke it down how women view betas and how women view simps. But we still like to entertain betas and simps because see, betas and simps got two things and got one thing in common. They both pedestalize women. Both of them. They do that. That's what they have in common. But they are very different. Beta and simp is not the same thing. A lot of people are like, oh, you're a beta or you're a simp. Well, which one is which? You just throwing the two together. It's like calling a woman a uh, um a hoe and calling her a slut. It's a difference between being a slut and being a hoe. That's a difference. A hoe choose who she wanna fuck. A slut sleeps with anybody. A hoe is not gonna sleep with everybody. She might sleep with three men off the football team, but she's not gonna screw the whole football team. A slut would. She she a slut. Looks at validation from a man. And not just that. She just in tune with the cock. You know what I mean? The, it does it for her. It turns her on. So she doesn't have a problem with fucking random different men. A hoe. She dictate who she want to fuck. And how she want to fuck you. And how she want to suck you. That's two different things. A, a hoe and a slut is two different things. So that's like calling a man a simp when he's not a simp. He's just a beta. Betas are in their in, in their emotions. Betas don't know how to control themselves. So they're always beating on a feminine type of, you know what I mean? 
Like a, a man with money could still be a simp. Doesn't mean that he's beta. He's not going to get in his emotions. But he's still like the simp on women. He might like the pleasures of pain women. That doesn't mean he's beta. Because he doesn't get in his emotions when it comes to women. Because he used his money to get women. That's not beta. Beta is an emotional man. A, a man that's triggered by women. Anything women do. That get them caught up in their feelings. So you got to understand the two. You can't just be throwing shit out there. You got to understand who we dealing with. It's, it's come on now. Dropping this motherfucking game. I'm, I'm going to give y'all some gems. I'm going to give y'all more than gems today. Because I want you to understand this shit. This is the type of things that you should have learned when you were younger. And if you're lacking it. All you got to do is pay attention. You know what I mean? Just pay attention. So. When it comes to. The hole and the slut. See the hole. There's a fine line of who she screwed. She's not screwing everybody. She choose and dictate who she fucks. The slut doesn't do that. So. When we say a bait and a simp. The number one thing. That the slut and the hole have in common. Is. The male penis. <laughs> That's the only thing they have in common. Is the male penis. But it's it's a difference there. Do you get what I'm saying? It's still a difference. Just like the beta and the simp. And what correlates the beta to the simp. Is pedestalizing women. See because the beta pedestalizes women. Not knowing he's doing that. He doesn't know because he was never taught that. And then he submits to his emotions when it comes to a woman that's a beta. A simp, he knows what he's doing because he's going to get what he wants out of doing it. He already has had a women. There are a lot of simps that already know I'm going to the strip club. I'm going to pay women for head because I want head. Do you get what I'm saying? The simp already know what he wants. So he act upon it to get what he want from the bitch. The beta doesn't know that. The beta goes in blindfold. He goes in blindfold. Do you get it? Do you understand that? So it's a clear difference. So women. <coughs> excuse me. I'm sorry, y'all. Women. Let me let me change up the tempo real quick. Yeah, there's a lot of betas and simps in relationships. Women will still fuck you and get in a relationship with you. I never say a woman is not gonna fuck a beta or a simp. I always keep it a hundred over here. To some women, they like turning you the fuck out. It's a turn on. It's a turn on to put that pussy on you. It is not gonna hurt nobody by putting that putting that pussy on you. You get what I'm saying? You know, your girl over here, I keep it real with you. A woman will fuck a beta, a beta in the simp. That that ain't like there's a lot of women that's married to their beta and simp, and she's happy because she gets what she like how men go through droughts without getting pussy. Women go through droughts when they don't have a simp or a beta. Somebody they can play play on. Someone that they can get what they want from a man. We go through droughts like that. So it's kind of like to get a to get a score. The score is the score. You the score. So we go through droughts. Some women go through droughts and some women don't like that shit. Women don't like to have droughts. So when she come across you and your ass is paying, oh yeah, you an easy score. So I'm going to get you to think that I like you. To keep you in that mindset. The same way men have drought when it comes to pussy, we have drought when it comes to a simp or a beta. It just depends on what she's looking for. It just depends. That's like, let me get you men to understand what I'm talking about. That's like me in a slut. But you got fat sluts, you got skinny sluts. You got ball sluts, you got pretty sluts, you got ugly sluts, right? It just depends on what slut you want to fuck, right? That's how it is for women. You got ugly simps, you got fat simps, you got skinny simps, you got big simps, you got aggressive simps, you got soft simps, 
you got white simps, you got Spanish simps. It just depends on what simp she wants. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm breaking it down the best way I can so you guys can understand what I'm talking about. I want you to understand what I'm talking about. And that's how it is when we go through a drought. But once we get a simp, it's kind of like, yes, I finally got one. I finally got a beta or a simp. It just depends on what she's looking for in that simp. Do you understand that? So we date. Yes, we go out. We date betas. We date simps. Because it's like a score to us. Because we go through droughts that maybe I don't want to deal with that beta. Or I don't want to deal with that simp. Or I don't want to deal with him because even though he's showing me that he has qualities in him, I don't have time because it seems like he deal with a lot of women that that don't give up the goods right then. Because some, some, with some simps, they'll tell you, listen, girl, I take care of you. Just be there when I, when I call you, be there. Something like a sugar daddy. Some women don't want simps like that. They want the simps that are dumb. Like, they want the Sims that you don't have to do much to get his money. You don't even have to see his ass and you get his money. Do you get what I'm saying? Or like a beta that will get in his feelings and prove itself. So if I can get you in your feelings, just start an argument with you. And then there you go trying to prove yourself. There you go saying, I can take, I can, I, I, you know, I can. You know, you could be the man for the fucking job, whatever the job is. I don't want to go down the goddamn list. If you get what I'm saying. But with betas, it's easy to trigger you to get you to prove yourself for the woman. Like I said in my last live stream, I got to edit that live stream because you two trip it. They blocked it. <laughs> they blocked that last live stream. Not the one with 5K, the other live stream with 2.5K. They blocked the live stream I did yesterday. So I'm editing it. I got to edit it. Then it'll be back up. But in that live stream, I talk about how women will flip the strip on you to be to be the beta male. She will flip the strip on you. So, yeah, women do that. So it's kind of like trolling you to get to get you to do what I want. Or acting like a dumb blind. I, I don't know anything. I don't know. Teach me. Show me. And there you go teaching her and showing her. Do you get what I'm saying? Do you understand what I'm saying? 